A jury is set to decide the case of a Newark police officer accused of shooting two men, one of them fatally, after a wild pursuit. Among the charges, aggravated manslaughter and misconduct. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor was in the courtroom in Newark for the second day of closing arguments. Stop the call! Was Newark police officer Giovanni Crespo justified in firing those shots? The prosecution and defense have made their final arguments to the jury. This law enforcement officer saved lives that night. End of story. That the defendant's version of events does not justify his use of deadly force. And that is why he has to continue to add to and change his story as he goes. Crespo's attorney interrupted the prosecutor at one point. A lie, Judge. It's a flat out lie. In January 2019, driver Gregory Griffin was pulled over for speeding. An officer noted he had a gun. Hands on the wheel. Griffin fled the initial traffic stop, leading police on a high speed chase. Crespo responded as backup. He's seen on body worn camera firing his gun at the suspect's car at three different locations. Crespo shot and killed Griffin and injured his passenger, Andrew Dixon. During the trial, Crespo took the stand in his own defense, claiming a gun was pointed at him. I stopped the threat. Prosecutors say Crespo's police report he wrote himself never described the danger as imminent, just that the threat posed by the vehicle was that it was moving at a high rate of speed. It's about what will happen, not about what could happen during an encounter. Reckless and ignored all policy and training in this incident. Not even close to official misconduct. The judge is expected to charge the jury tomorrow morning. Then they'll begin deliberations. If convicted, he could face up to life in prison. Outside of the Essex County Veterans Courthouse, Alice Gaynor, CBS 2 News. And Crespo is currently suspended from the Newark Police Department.